As the deep freeze continues, thousands of central Texans remain in the dark and many don't know when their lights, their heat will come back on. Six News reporter Barry Roy spoke with some of those people today as they try to make sense of all of this. It was going to be like really worried because I have one of them who have asthma and the other one cannot deal with the cold. When we got power back, it had been about 70 hours um, since we'd had it. It's kind of like the apocalypse. Um, we did not prepare to lose power. That's not something we ever thought was going to happen. Central Texans have been living through a nightmare. We had the stuff all day Saturday. Well, we've got our third big one. And the um, emotions of Mother Nature's fury unrelenting. We have a two-year-old, so anger, frustration, of course. Um, just it, uh, overall, it's a sense of powerlessness. Actually, we cannot move. We cannot do anything. We cannot go nowhere. We're freezing. We're freezing. The animals are so cold. We Tiny Hooves like Rescue them. and Petting Zoo turning their home into a barn and losing a miniature cow they tried desperately to save to Mother Nature. We sat with her and she actually died in my arms. And the only thing that we know that it could have been is her body went into shock from the cold. Right now we feel angry. We feel impotent. We feel um, beyond frustrated. We're leaving from paycheck to paycheck. Now we can't even go to work. And our food is getting bad. No, the I anger, the frustration, the worry, with a little thanks mixed in with sorrow. Learning how to survive has been um, an unreal experience that we never thought we would have to um, experience, but we have, and I think that we're doing a fairly good job on staying alive, and we wouldn't be able to stay alive without the community, friends, amazing neighbors. In Temple, Barry Roy, Six News. Now, if you or anyone you know does need help, we do have several stories over on our website, kcentv.com, where you can look for some assistance. You can also call 311 if you live in the city and you need to find a warming shelter, 211 if you live in a rural area and you need to find one of those places to get warm.